Hello, my viewers. This is um, Ola reaching you live from, from London. Um, it's been a while now that I've actually been able to bring in some of this um, lovely um, chat with you guys. But, I mean, today I'm going to look into the, the, the continuation of this visa application. I mean, there are a few questions that come from people that actually want to travel, and traveling from the UK to every other part of the world or from from other part of the world into the UK. I mean, many people actually want to come to the UK, as we all know. And then um, there is actually a specific question that one of um, my viewers actually asks about traveling with refugee documents. And that's what I actually want to address today. I mean, if you have um, a refugee document, it's obvious that you're running away from wherever you're coming from. So you're seeking refuge in the UK. So, and then now that you're in the UK, you, you are given a refugee status. So, but with that refugee status, you're not a prisoner. So you actually, you still have some freedom, but you need to actually know what your refugee document, now what, 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 what it entails, what it can give you. That the thing is, my personal, my personal advice is, um, of course, if you're running away from a country that you're not seeking refuge in, in the UK, it, it, will, it will sound up saying that you're going back to the place that you're actually running away from because of fear of your life. So, but having said that, there are countries, if you have a um, refugee travel document, which is like a blue, uh, it's, it's a blue passport that is actually issued, in the UK here, there are some countries that you can actually go visa-free, and there are some countries you cannot go visa-free. So if you actually want to travel, you have to actually check. But I mean, just but but the the is called the refugee doc, travel documents, which is blue, issued under the 1951 UN Convention. So and then there are countries that require visa for you to actually go to, even though you are still holding a refugee travel document. That includes Afghanistan, Argentina, Albania, Algeria, Angola, Andorra. Yep, you need visa to there. Australia, Azerbaijan, Belarus, Belgium, Bolivia, Bosnia, Herzegovina, Bulgaria, Brazil, um, Cambodia, Canada, China, Cuba, Cyprus. Czech Republic, Denmark, Dominican Republic, Egypt, Estonia, France, Georgia, Greece, India, uh, Iceland, Indonesia, Israel, Jamaica, Japan, Kazakhstan, Kenya, um, Latvia, Mali, Malta, Mexico, Macedonia, and Malaysia. Um, it's, it's, the, the list goes on like that. Uh, but there are some countries that you don't actually require a visa, you know, to go when you have a refugee document. According to the um, refugee travel document issued under the 1951 UN Convention, if that's what you're holding. So you can actually go to Armenia, Austria, Croatia, Finland, Georgia, Germany, Hungary, Israel, yeah, Italy, Kosovo, yeah, you can go to Lithuania, Luxembourg, Moldova, Monaco, Montenegro, Netherlands, Romania, South Mar Marino, South Africa, South Korea, Switzerland, Tunisia. And Vatican City, but I mean, and you have to actually check, you know, check with the with the um, consulate as well. Make sure that you clarify yourself that things has not actually changed when you're applying for it. So, but make sure that you you get all the paperwork correctly so that when you are coming back, you're not restricted. So, but the thing is, at least according to the UN Convention. 1951, the UN Convention, so the travel refugee docu uh, travel documents enable you to go to certain countries visa free. And there are some countries that you actually need to apply for the visa to go to. 
But the thing is, the country you're actually running away from that you're seeking refuge in this country about, I wouldn't advise you to turn to go there so you don't risk your own life because you are actually running from something. That's why you actually seek refuge in this country. Thank you very much. Please be on the lookout for more of my videos. Let your questions be coming in. Leave your comments down below. Subscribe, share your likes, and then um, I'll be more than happy to answer your question. And good luck in your visa application, your traveling. Thank you.